Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today we are going to do a Dollar Tree. It's kind of like a haul, but it's not all done in one. Um, I've This is like a couple of trips, and so um, I wanted to show you some good finds, some great stocking stuffers, some great snacks, and um, a fun few little toys and stuff. Um, that the kids are gonna like and some beauty items. So if you're interested in seeing some of the hidden gems at the Dollar Tree, stick around. Okay, so I found some things that I was actually looking for. I would seen on some other people's Dollar Tree hauls and this one is super exciting. I did buy two of them. Um, I am currently, this is going to be day one of me getting back on keto and nothing that I bought is keto, but they are a great deal and even if we don't end up eating them right away, the expiration isn't until May of 2019, so we have plenty of time, um, but these are super awesome. These are the Nature Valley Almond Butter um, Granola Nut Bars. I have hauled these once before, but they were the peanut butter, not the almond butter. So we do still have a box of the peanut butter. But these are super great for anybody who likes to do like outdoor activities, hiking. Um, if your kids will eat these, these are great to throw in their sn uh, snack bag, lunch box, anything like that. And um, yeah, there's five bars in each box. So I did buy two because I thought they were a really good deal. I think these normally go for like three, four, even, maybe even five dollars depending on what store um, so for a one dollar excellent deal so super excited about those um, the next food item is not that exciting these are just a little bag of grab-and-go Cheez-Its because I'm running out of ideas to put in PJ and Jack's uh, lunch bag they get lunch uh, lunch sorry snack um, every day and it kind of has to be just like quick and easy um, snacks but she has pj has not been eating what i've been giving to her i think she's getting burnt out so i'm trying to switch it up so um i think she'll like those she used to call them crunchers but um i'm sure she'll like those um the next food item i bought these are so good but they're not my favorite and these are the biscolata cookies um they are dark chocolate orange and like a shortbread and these are pretty good but the absolute best ones are the lemon. And the lemon ones come with white chocolate and I am on the hunt for those. Those are one of my all time favorite cookies and I am going to be hopping around from Dollar Tree to Dollar Tree, stocking up because these, they are so good. If you, I don't even know, they're just so good. Um, if you like lemon and if you like white chocolate, you are definitely going to like those. They are so delicious. Um, but I was so excited to see these back. I will eat them eventually when I'm not on keto. Um, and the expiration date is not till July 26th of 2019, so they can stick around for a little bit. And um, it's not a food item, but kitchen items, just snack bags. Um, Ziploc bags and stuff are so expensive and so I really enjoy buying um, these ones. I use these for the kids um, Lunch boxes. I'll put like baby carrots in there or I'll probably put some of these Cheez-Its in there and for a dollar You get 50 bags and they are just going in the trash. They don't need to be holding anything for a long period of time So for a dollar excellent deal um, I do have one two three toy items that I'm gonna save for um, stocking stuffers. And these here are squishies. Um, they are super soft and they are actually really great for sensory, um, for kids with special needs are really, not, I love them myself. And I got them some a while back. I got them a pineapple and a lemon, and it was so cute. I saw that they had little animals, so I got um, a unicorn and a tiger, and they did have other fruits and other animals, but we don't really need a dozen of these. Um, but they are super nice, and um, I recommend going to maybe pick some up if you want, like to donate for Toys for Tots or a, 
you are a special needs family, um, do you have like an ABA therapy or anything like that? These would be great for donations. Um, and they are so relaxing. They just like, and they just come back to life. They are so soft, so, so soft. And so the kids like these. So I got them those. And then this one, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna regret. <sighs> okay, so small story. I went to the Dollar Tree a couple weeks ago and I found this slime, which is also great for sensory. And it was in this little container and it was brown and it was called poo. And Jackson absolutely loved it. And um, last Friday I went to a book club and I get a phone call from Dustin saying that Jack got um, the slimes in his hair. And so he worked on getting it out the next day, it turns out. Um, it was still stuck in there and it was really hard. We had to get coconut oil and Don just soap and we, we almost had to shave his head. It was really bad. But uh, moving on, I saw this and it's called Poo Juice Splat Ball. And it's like, what is that? And it's squishy. And these are so good for sensory as well. And um, this one's supposed to, you're supposed to just throw it and it'll stick to things, but I, I feel I'm going to regret this one, but it was so funny and Jack's going to like it. So, um, the next items I have are like beauty items and the ones I'm going to show you first, they are for, I guess, kids, which are, would also be a fantastic stocking stuffer or... Uh, if you have um, a teenager or a tween or anything like that, kids who like to take uh, bubble baths, look at these. They are bath bombs and they are the uh, airheads. We've got, this one is the blue raspberry. This one is the, oh my goodness, the strawberry. And this one is watermelon. And I believe they had a few others as well. And, and then the Crayola ones, this one, um, they actually change colors. So this one goes from green, blue to teal, and this one goes red, blue to purple. And they seem like they're going to fairly decent size um, bath bombs. So PJ absolutely loves bubble baths. We have the big jet tub, and she just loves it. So last year for her ninth birthday, we didn't know what to give her, so... We got her like a big thing of bath bombs and just bubbles and just like a whole bath set and she loved it and so these are great for um for little kids um, and stocking stuffers for a dollar these are really good they also had um disney princess ones and i took a picture i'll put those i'll try to put those at the end of the video and from what I understand, they my store didn't have it, um, but they are having like the Mickey Mouse, Minnie Mouse, Paw Patrol, PJ Masks, and all these Disney um, themed bath bombs. And so um, super great to look out for. Um, yeah, great find. And so next few items. This I this is Global Beauty Care, and it is a mask. And it's supposed to be a gold mask. I don't know. It's a dollar. Um, I don't know how well it's going to work, but I'm going to try it. I'll try anything. Help. Let's see. It says, with mask applicator, helps with reducing fine lines and wrinkles, 15-minute facial therapy. So, yeah. We're going to try that. And if it doesn't work, it's just a dollar. So, the next one, Bolero has new products out. Um, I have bought a lot of Bolero products in the, in, the, in the past. I have lotions and body oils, bath bombs, bath fizzers, uh, facial wipes. Those are the ones I use most often. And so they kind of have some new products out and some new scents out, um, which I'm kind of excited about. They, I got the coconut cream and vanilla and they had another one which was like an orange something or other but I don't like orange at all really except for those um, but I don't really like the scent of it so um, the first item here is a face scrub it's a um, exfoliating let's smell how does this smell it's sealed up real nice let's see if I can up 
Oh, that smells really good. Hmm. So, I'm excited to try that. And I am like the cheapest person when it comes to skincare and all that. So, um, but Bolero is um, a fairly decent brand. And it's kind of hit and miss. Um, I actually have a bunch of their hand soaps. And I'm not the biggest fan of them. But, um, yeah. I like their facial wipes, though. And so, this one is the Foot Scrub. And I am always up for a foot scrub. I'm not going to open that because it's the same scent as the rest of it. So they, I've never seen the um, face scrub or the foot scrub before. So I was super excited to see those. And I wasn't sure if my stores were going to get them. So the next one is a body scrub with a coffee powder. So I'm pretty excited about that because coffee is supposed to be um, really good for your skin. It's supposed to really help with tightening. So... Um, yeah, I'm really excited to try all of this out. And the last thing I got is also um, same scent and everything, but it's a uh, facial mask. So I am, I'm always up for a facial mask. Um, oh, let me see what I got right here. These are also some masks that they have. Um, I took some pictures below and they have a ton of them. Um, I bought these a couple weeks ago, but they are the Yes To masks. Um, these are the uh, sleeping mask, moisturizing sleeping mask for dry skin, and then another sleeping mask for vitamin C boosting and brightening, and then the um, the uh, mud mask. And there's they have a ton of other ones, and these are normally about three bucks at Target. It's a Target brand, and so. Um, Super great deal, and these are also awesome for teacher gifts for Christmas. I don't know if you all give out gifts to your kids' teachers. I do. I appreciate everything they they do, and I really try to spoil them and give them some nice things. And they all need some relaxation thing, I'm sure, during Christmas vacation. So I would highly recommend go pick some of these up and give them to your teachers. And then get them for yourselves because you're going to have your kids on Christmas break and we're all gonna need some of these. So, and these also, what a great look. One, two, three, four bucks right there. Like, tell me, like, what teacher wouldn't enjoy these? And I've got four teachers to buy for this year and it can add up. So I am definitely gonna um, be working on some teacher gifts. And I like to give them some nice things that they're actually gonna enjoy. They. Most teachers really do enjoy like a Starbucks gift card, um, which I am not opposed to giving. But I don't know, I like to have fun with it and try to really put some thought into it. So um, yeah, that is it for my Dollar Tree haul. I can't even talk. I think it's because I haven't had any breakfast and it's day one back on keto and I gotta pull myself together. But that is it for today if you enjoy my haul videos and give me a uh, a thumbs up subscribe to my channel um, share to anybody you think that would like watching me i have a few other videos coming up here soon i'm still trying to figure out um some stuff with my my phone since that's how i do all of my video editing uploading and all that so um it's a work in progress and Hopefully soon I will get it all worked out and I can be more consistent with my videos. But I thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video and you have a fantastic day. Bye.